getting started in just a little while, everybody. We'll be getting started on the um, two minute mark, so get that sales prepared and we'll get started very soon. This is going to be an interesting uh, experience. Ooh. <sighs> Let's see how long it takes three minutes to uh, not, uh, pop in the chat and let me know that I'm live. <laughs> Okay, there's stream elements. And just in time too, because it's now past the two minute mark, so hey ho my fellow Rumble Maniacs, it's Mr. Rumble Roses here. And welcome to a special Wolf of Sign 3 or uh, Wolf of Sign 3D mod special. Today we're gonna be playing some Wolf of Doom. Now I recently I now a few days ago I did a poll on my Twitter, which um uh, if someone in the chat was to, was to put exclamation point Twitter, you can be able to get a link to my Twitter. And, uh, yeah. So, I did a poll asking you guys what you, what you wanted to see from two options that I had in mind. The first one was of Shadow Warrior Classic Redux, where I played episode 2 live. And the second one was the Wolfenstein 3D Mod Special, which is this. And despite the few votes that it had, because because pretty much only three people voted in total, but the winner was this. So let's talk a little bit about Wolf and Doom. At least, like, I guess you know. Let's let, let's kind of build up to how I discovered this per se. So. When it comes to Wolf and Doom, if you know, if you, you can probably tell by the name itself, it's a combination of thing that's combining Wolfenstein and Doom. The first time I ever found, found out about something called Wolf and Doom was um was through was through a mod for Doom for Doom, more specifically Doom 2, called Wolf and Doom. Basically, it was a mod created by I want to say Las Ro Rojas, if I pronounce that name wrong, I'm sorry, but, um, it's basically a mod that, like, remade Wolfstein 3D's episodes and stuff in, in the Doom engine, and it was, it was a nice alternative way to play, uh, Wolf 3D if you didn't have, like, uh, you know, the original game or something else. Um, Wolf and Doom came in two mods, or wads, I guess you could say. Um, first mod had episodes 1 through 3, and the other mod had episodes 4 through 6. And then, well, even though I don't know if this is how it happened, like, originally, but I just know this, I just know this from, like, my experience, person, mostly. <laughs> but, then comes Wolfenstein 3D mods, and I have to come across a mod that was called Wolf and Doom. Now, this now this Wolf and Doom mod was made by someone named R.I.P. And I'm not talking about like the R.I.P. letters themselves. I'm talking about like A R E Y E P. <laughs> <coughs> Originally, a Wolf and Doom was done to be for like a DOS box type of type of thing, but 
usually DOSBox kind of sucks when it tries to when you try to like play games on it slash record or stream or whatever. But uh, this version, but, but someone by the name of Astro Creep had ported, had, had like made a mod port type of thing to where you could be able to play this on EC Wolf or LZ Wolf, depending on you know, your depending on your favorite type, I guess. <laughs> but basically, Astro Creep made this into once one whole one whole wall, so you could play it, you know, easier instead of having to use a whole bunch of stuff. So yeah. Now, what with this mod, there's new episodes, some new enemies. Um, there's a few weapons, but it seems like there's only, but it seems like there's not a whole lot. Um, there's some enemies, all of which I don't know if all of them are going to be Doom related, but I do know a certain common enemy. And, um, yeah. So, in this, in this episode, I'm going to be, or in this part, I'm going to be playing UAC Site 1, the first encounter, aka episode 1, and see how that goes. Now, just like in Wolfenstein, and just like in Spear Destiny, I'm not going to play on like the higher difficulties, I'm just going to play it on, on the second difficulty, which is like, it's sort of easy, but it has a little bit of, a little bit of challenge in it, so, yeah. So, as you can see, our weapon, our pistol, is actually the Doom Pistol. And our knife is the Doom Fist. And the key and the keys apparently are the normal Doom keys. Like the you know, normal normal key cards. Oh, excuse me. Now this is going to be a blind let's play, so, you know, I might be stuck at times, I might not know what I'm supposed to do, whatever, but, oh, excuse me, but, um, I did play test episode 1, level 1, and hey Onyx, how you doing? Nice to see you, I'm glad you're here. But, um, but yeah, as I was saying, I have play tested episode 1, level 1. Welcome Shadow Seed and thank you for sharing the stream. Mucho appreciate all A. I mean, but yeah, I played I play this level and that's about it. Anything else beyond this is gonna be brand new to me. So <laughs> Cheddar. So, one thing I noticed. So, one thing I know about this about this mod is that it seems like the treasure is the um the like the blue skull keys that you get in Doom as as alternate keys or secondary keys. But I will say, like, I am, I am curious to see, like, how how this mod is gonna play out. Cause if you if you know me and you know my kind of type of content, I do like me some interesting crossovers, and this is an interesting crossover. <laughs> In this case, it'd be like the regular stem packs, but that, uh, but I do get get what you mean. <laughs> Ouch! So, so far, I know that I'm, I've noticed that like the um, the normal enemies are actually just doom guys, but the one thing that kind of Hello. 
But the one thing that kind of makes me a little bit question this a little bit is, I mean, not that this is bad. <laughs> Anyone else? Can I, can I speak what I was going to say now? Bitch. <laughs> anyway, the one thing I find kind of weird is that if you hear the if you if you heard the sound whenever the Doom guy was shooting or Doom Marines was shooting, it sounded like the the icon of sin noise where it spawns in the cube uh, thing. So I don't know what's up with that. And I will say this. Uh, I, and I will say this now to the people in chat, and um, you know later for those who watch this as a vod, feel free to make it. Feel free, feel free to make some clips if you want. You know, I mean, any any clip is welcome as far as what I do, whether it be some random or some silly. You know, it's, clips are welcome to one and all. I gotta remember that there's a big mech hit right there. It is kind of a bummer a little bit that um, the music hasn't been changed to like something Doom related, but it's fine. Hi, Onyx. Say hi to your landlady for me. Okay, so that's one of the, so I guess this is a locked door. And this is not the, the one that I have already. I'm trying to remember um, where the other key is. I've only played this level like once and that's it. And already I've forgotten about what I need to do. I'm there, I need to go. Ouch. That stung. I'm gonna hunt for that uh, that med kit again. The big one. Save. Excuse me. Ouch. Fucker. Ow. Ugh. 
I feel like there's gotta be some sort of way in there. There we go. Maybe. Yeah, I found secret. I think another missed opportunity for this mod is, um, ouch, is, um, the fact that they didn't have, like, the Doom, the Doom Marine death sound whenever you kill them. But, it's no biggie. to expect with, with, with the rest of this level. <laughs> Welcome back, Onyx. Um, I'm just now starting episode 1, level 2, and basically going into blind territory now, because I don't know what to expect with this, with this mod now. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it, it could be, you yeah. know. Thanks for interesting reactions and such. <laughs> I'm assuming this is one of the locked doors. Ow. Stupid.
more locked doors possibly. So here's one of the new weapons. It's it's weird because it's like it looks like it would be a rocket launcher, right? But it fires like a plasma. It, it almost, but it, it's it looks like a rocket launcher. Sounds like a plasma rifle. But functions what could be the MP40. Yeah, I mean, I, I I I can't tell I can't tell you how many times I've seen like people Franken Sprite um a lot of no weapons to make something new. again. By now, originally one three eight. You know they didn't. They don't do that sort of thing. Okay, so I'm gonna assume that that these three areas, that this area right here, is for uh, locked doors. That's where we came from. Look at him; he's doing serpentine. Ow! That's motherfucker. Oh, it's all tricks, you doodles.
Hello, housekeeping. <sighs> the one thing I kind of hate about Wolfenstein in general is that, like, if you have more than one enemy on 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 the um in in like your field of view or whatever, it's like it's like the, what the other enemy can shoot through can shoot can shoot through almost anything. Like you know, he could he could, he can shoot through this guy or something, but whatever. Bathroom reflection! Alright, two doors left. Woo! That fucking hurt. Progress and got some health. Walk over here and I, I, I pick up, picked up some. I couldn't see what it was. I, I didn't know if it was health or something else. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I'm just figuring. Out, I'm just trying to figure out like where I need to go. Cause like, I can't go in here, and I assume that this is like, uh, I assume that this is probably going, that, that, that this is a key door area. Should have some progress. Hello there. Woo -woo -woo. Ow. It won't come at me at once, damn it. 
Ouch. It sucks that you can't be able to like destroy these or gain some health from them in some way. Alright, got the first key card. I can only think of two two things. One, the secret the secret to this is in a weird spot. Or two, the original mod creator has probably do, probably put this here to be an absolute dick. <laughs> Whatever. At least we got a key of some kind. Indeed. Makes me want. Makes me wonder if like. It makes me wonder if like they knew what they were doing, or if they were just being an absolute. You know, or, or, or that person was being just an absolute dick. Skull keys. So I guess the chalices and the um the tre the treasure chest are red and blue skull keys. Okay, so I guess this is pretty much just a treasure room. By the way, um, I know I did this. I, I know I did this um, kind of late last night, in the, into the hours of the morning or whatever. But I did a test stream of Sonic Bull, and it's spelled B O L L. Um, so if you haven't seen that already, and I'm, and I'm not, and I'm not just talking about to those who are in the chat right now, but for those who are also watching this later on Twitch or on YouTube. You know, I I say that as a vod or highlight on my um on my Twitch that I may be posting it on my YouTube. But uh, I I get I played a Sonic CD themed edition of Sonic Bull. And in case in case people are wondering like what is, what exactly is Sonic Ball? It's basically like Super Mario Brothers, but you can better have like the likes of Sonic and uh, other characters as well, like you know, from Luigi or like just char custom characters, you know, as uh, skin mods. It's it's pretty cool actually. It can, it's kind of like the um, Super Mario Bros. crossover fan game. Alright. 
We now got both keys on our possession. Another bathroom inspection? Someone was actually in one this time. I got both keys and yeah, I still can't go through here. I guess. And th unless there's a random surprise, and I guess maybe you can't don't go through that door. Aha! I found me a chain gun. Got, got, you gotta love that 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 tune whenever you get the chain gun. <laughs> I figure like where I haven't been that I can actually go to. Ouch. Fadurusa. And there's the exit. Bullet. I'd acquire health. So one, four, three, portal one. 
So, by that name alone, I would assume that there, whether we might see some some demons? Question mark? <laughs> Only one way to find out, though. Okay, so there's a possible secret around this area. First key card. I gotta say, I'm, I, I'm, my interest, my, my, my curiosity interest is peaked in this mod. <laughs> I know, right? Okay, I think I'm starting to see that, like what they're going for in terms of like how you know what a, what a locked door is. I guess apparently like I guess this is representing like a, a locked door. Only problem is you never know that as to which colored door thing it's for. But at least at least we learn at least we learn a little something something. Okay. So we, so even though they, they don't have like uh, certain colors to them, they have a certain uh, uh, way of telling things apart, at least. Because you can see like the triangle thing is pointing this way, and this one's pointing that way. Okay. That was close. Curious, sir, and curious, sir. Okay, that's where we started.
Okay. I'm, I'm trying to I'm trying to think about how the the original key orders are from top to bottom, but it, I but I guess but I guess like the blue key cards are for doors that had the triangle point right, and yellow keys are pointing or and yellow key doors are triangles that point left. So yeah. So, blue, so, I guess, so I guess like um, blues are rights, yellows are lefts. I actually think I actually think you can remember that for me, or maybe call it or something. <laughs> I was saying, I was saying, I think I figured out the whole situation with the key, uh, the um, the key card doors. Like, I think, I think from what I, from, from from what I can understand in this mod, blue keys are for doors that have the triangle going right. Yellow keys are for triangles that go left. So like, blue left, blue equals left, yellow or blue equals right. Yellow equals left. As far as like you know, no, no one the difference between um, the key card doors. Yeah. That that that's what I'm that's what I'm thinking at least. sign danger experimental area keep out well as the old saying goes brace your ass oh we have found our first demon and it's an imp. And did you hear that sound that it made, though? I know, right? So, 
So I guess now we're in hell. I'm gonna take a wild guess and say that the imps are the SS Nazis or the shoe stuffles. And it seems like armor is also like part of um, treasure. I know that now I know that originally these are like health bonuses, but either they're like one health things for this mod or they might just be props, I don't know. Ow. Okay, they are health items. Well, yeah, I mean, but like, I I didn't know as far as like how the mod uh, was going to be for this, but. <laughs> I mean, you, you gotta admit, you know, like, you, you, you would think, you know, do, with Doom logic, like, you would get those and you can actually go, you know, past 100. So apparently we have two doors. <laughs> so Onyx, um, pick a door for me, left or right. Well, nothing bad, but this <laughs> is. At least we, at least, at least if like, um, if anyone wants to play this, then they need some house, they can have, get some right here. Alright, episode one, floor four, back alleyways. So, Spectres, possibly replacement for the uh, Rot Rot Rottweilers. And they seem to move kind of fast, too. See, see, we're slowly but surely learning about, like, how how this mod is as far as like you know the items and the weaponry and you know and the enemy types too you know what you know what this looks like it looks like specter jibs like 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 you know whenever you um give an enemy in doom and they turn to like the, the pile of mush Yeah, well, yeah, this does this mod this mod does seem pretty solid, and um, I am kind of I am liking it so far. I'm curious to see uh, more down the road. <laughs> I okay. Ouch. That's another one for the history books, I guess. Alright, 
Alright, let's save it right now. Motherfucker! The mess would be with with love <laughs> oh god on X. <laughs> And I gain a life, it seems. Which no offense, which no offense to Wolf 3D, but I think like lives are a complete another useless thing. Ow, ow, ee, ooh, ow, fuck shit, ow. <laughs> yeah, first one in the game so far. Woo! I can see, I can see the Spectre Imps in this mod being a pain. True, true. And that is the true. Okay, so another no okay, so another little note is, it seems like the health bonuses are the dog food of this mod. <laughs> Alright, so, found, found a key door, now we just need some keys. Yeah, it does. I mean, as I said before, like you know, I'm I'm pretty much blind to this mod, so I don't know as to what what's changed and what you know equals what. So, so we are learning together, ladies and gentlemen. What I know, you know now too. If that if, if it if it's actually in this mod. Alright, another Kidawa. I mean, unless if I had like a thing where um, its second form was like, I don't know, I, I don't know if I want to say more cyberized or something, where it's like uh, one, one, one hand was a machine gun or a rocket launcher or something. I mean, I, I mean, being someone who's played a lot of Doom mods and seen like people make monster variants of things. Thank you, thank you. Um, you 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 can never know as like, as to what kind of freakish creations you're gonna see in some mods. Down.
sorry, I was just, I was looking at the chat again to, I was scrolling up the chat to see, um, about the doors. Any she might like some mod player that just st play stuff on God. Yeah, I mean, I tr I try to play things like you know normal ish per se. You know, like I mean, I when it comes to when it comes to like mods, I do you know see if I can try like you know make some interesting features and all that. But yeah, I don't always play. I don't I I don't always use God mode. It's just like uh, some is really annoying or like some is like so like lag breaking or not lag breaking but lag if it's if something's laggy and you know it's just other bullshittery then I would use god mode but other than that I don't use god mode well you know you, well that's just how some people can be you know some people just can be straight up assholes, but I mean... Yeah. Ooh! I don't know if secret! Too bad this mod doesn't have any extra weaponry that has its own ammo pool. <laughs> yeah, happy demon with a lot of with a lot of uh, uh stim packs. I was trying to I was trying to think of what they what they're called. <laughs> So we so we need some that's what it doors. Keys. Some, some like, some are set together for challenge or whatever. I suppose so. Uh, 
Hey, I got all the kills at least. <laughs> Alright, so episode 1 for 5 is called Nasty Finish. Wonder why that is. <laughs> I guess we'll I guess we'll re uh, find out together now, won't we? I heard that. That's either a zombie man or a shotgunner. I do I do not know. But going by Doom logic, that, that but going by Doom logic, that was either a, a zombie man or a shotgunner. I feel like this is leading up to a boss. Shot from the front and bitten in the butt in the back. Or I guess in this case, like shot in the front, bitten in the back. Ugh. 
Once again, a two-door conundrum. Onyx, do you want to pick again, or... Right it is. Soul Sphere. Question is, where are you? Okay. That makes sense. It's an extra lot. It's, you know, that's a little like a one up. Okay, yeah. If we're getting the likes of a Soul Sphere, aka one up, ammo, and med kits. Yeah, this definitely smells. This definitely, this definitely reeks of a boss fight. Yeah, I'm, I'm assuming that's what it is. Um... Well... Would you look at this? A random square just... Doing not, not a thing. Just in case. Chain Gunner! Um... Okay, so... I'm gonna go on a limb here saying that the um, first boss of episode one is a chain gunner. <laughs> okay. Yep, shooting all the way. Get him! Can someone clip that? Please and thank you. Thank you. Ow, eat, fuck. Oh god. Now I'm worried. Well, damn. Well, maybe later if you... It's fine. I was, I was gonna say like maybe later if you can, you know, if you want, if you if you if you rewatch this as a highlight, you know, if all goes well, maybe then you can be able to do it from there or something. I don't know, but it's fine. I see yellow skull keys. Yeah, and if you do, you know, just. Um, Mess me on Facebook or something, you know, where, wherever you, however you want to mess with me, it's fine. You know, if you ever, uh, actually, if you, if you manage to do it. Well, 
at least I'm back at full health and full ammo. Still not a thing. Looks like I need a backtrack. Doors opening, and I don't know if it's me or someone else. It's wearing me though. Trying to look at the map and see like areas I've been to and you know which has not been uncovered. Okay, I see, I, I see a room. 
I have been to. I think I tried everything so far, but I mean I don't know for sure, but this this area right here may be something. I just gotta make my way back to the start. Which I was about to say like I'm not too far out, but then again I, I realize I have to do some crazy ass shit. Okay, so now I got both keys. Wait a minute. How many floors does episode how many floors does episode one have in Wolf 3D again? I forgot. <laughs> Ah, oh, there's some tantalizing! Some tells me this is gonna be like a cube shaped, um, or not, not a cube, but a square shaped level. Or if I want to lock doors. Ha <laughs> 
Gotta drink them health potions. Hey, I'm no fool, but I hope I hope you're enjoying the. the uh, I hope you're enjoying this so far while you're. Eating your cashews and drinking your coffee. Ouch. I appreciate the offer. Okay, so I guess technically I was right in saying that the map is going to be like a square shape, but like, I'm guessing that like, each of, each of these corner pieces or each of these corners or whatever is going to be a room that has some minimum. Let's save. <sighs> now I'm starting to wonder though, like if that chain gun there was actually a boss or something else. But the fish down is there. Later on down the later, later on down the road in his mud. Okay, so I'm going to assume that both both these doors are going to leave the same area. Yeah, probably. I mean, it, it wouldn't surprise me if, like, you know, somewhere if, like, um, we start seeing mini bosses before we see like the main bosses. UAC Foundry. Uh, for those who know the warning, beware the bombers. Huh. Interesting little warning.
I will say though, I am getting the same kind of Wolf and Doom type vibes um, from like the, from the Doom mod thing onto here, because like in the like because like in the mod. <laughs> Cause like in the mod, you had like your melee, you had your pistol, you had your MP40, and you had your chain gun, and that was it. There was no, there was no rockets or you know anything else. Thank you so kindly for lining up and being so generous and holding the door open with your a dead carcasses. This, 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 this. All right, so we found another one. <laughs> Viva Fum. I'm going to assume that this area right here is going to have some keys of some kind, whether it be one or both, I don't know. Key card. Is it stalking us?
You know, I just had a random five, but let's say, um, I I, I wonder if they, I wonder if they could do like an icon of sin type of thing with this mod. Like, I mean, I know that the icon of sin is John Romero and all that, but like, I can just randomly imagine like uh, one of the bosses just being you know John Romero's head on the stick, just, just like an Easter egg secret thing. Just thinking out loud and shit, you know? As nice as that was, that was not useful at all. I mean, hey, it's the truth, is it not? Oh boy, long, long hallway. So one on floor seven. Ooh. Okay, I couldn't even find, huh? So we're gonna see the fl the the flying red tomatoes. Like that, huh?
You heard that, dude. You, you heard that, right? Wow. Okay, so... Cacodemons are not a boss. Hmm. Well, there you go, you son of a bitch! your ass back here. Looks like this area requires the same key. I know, right? Fly away from me. I wonder what the, I wonder what the Cacodemons are, are, are replacing in this mod. I would assume another uh, bullet type enemy. Curious, sir, I'm curious, sir. I don't know, but it, it could be a possibility. Thank <laughs> you. 
Did you see that shit? They're trying to gang up on me. Not this time, stupid! Too bad the, uh, the melee is the chainsaw in this mod. All that for a blue, for a blue skull. of hate. <sighs> Let's see what you got. <sighs> so I'm assuming that this is going to be, uh, so I'm assuming this is the second to last level. If there's floor, if there's ten floors in episode one, so and somewhere there's a secret exit for one. Ouch! I was talking to my viewer, you son of a bitch and imp fucker. Likes to be an ass. <sighs> this must be the circle of death or destruction type level. Man, those hitboxes, I swear. Ow, 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 ow. Nope. Reload.
Oh, I need some ammo. The gods have spoken. Uh, our gods have listened. <laughs> They heard thy plea and they answered upon delivery. Skulls and the Yoki Doa. That was a weird sound. Makes what four times I've seen these things just floating in the air with no purpose at all. I have the feeling I ain't being watched. Not just by Twitch chat, but by something else in this game. I hate like whenever you look at the auto map or something. And it looks like, you know, you can have a, it, it, it looks like you can actually go through certain areas or whatever. And all of a sudden it's like, you know, you look and there's, you're cock blocked. Hello. That's dog.
Thank you for opening that door. Okay, that is now six times we have seen these. It's one of these, huh? Slow but sit steady serpentine. Alright, episode 149, the exit portal. So this oh, must be the finale of episode 1. No, you don't. Ooh. Bad demon doggy. Okay, so I see the blue key card. Whoa! Bad demon doggy. Don't make me don't make me six shadow seed on your ass. <laughs> what was that? That was painful. Mm 
Gibt's mir auch so viel? Oh shit. I can't have no choice. I can't have no choice at the moment I'm fucking... Ouchie! <laughs> it's like I really have no choice but to run. Yeah, but they all take up the same ammo pool, though. Did I just hear the arachnotron br uh, death sound? Yeah, see? All the, we all the weapons take up the same ammo slot. Motherfucker! annoying enough, they send two, just to piss you off. Woo! I'm trying. I'm just, I'm just trying not to get, I'm just trying to make sure they don't give me the fuck my treatment. And I'm out of bullets. Get one, get one, get one, get one, get one. I'm just running away! I don't have time for your shit, Mr. Imp! <laughs> what 
what is it? I wonder what the what enemies that are are that tough. Oh, the one time you ran at the fucking door. I wish when you got like a 1-up that you can actually be able to get some ammo too, like additional ammo. <sighs> I'm actually kinda nervous. Say, in one, a I mean, the thing I hate about it is like you know, you can't be able to stun like both of them. You can only do like one of them. I know, I know. In fact, it's like you know, when one is on your ass and another one's right behind them. Ugh. I hate to do it. I guess I gotta go chain gun guy, chain gun guy hunting.
<sighs> I just wish that I just wish that like they weren't fucking grouped grouped as a pair. Like if, like if I could somehow get one of them separated, then you know. It's a found them. Get in here, get in here. <sighs> One down. Yep. Question is, does Django and number two have the other key? Nope, he just had the same fucking key. So, met full health, plenty of ammo, took care of both of those chain gunner guys. Now, I gotta go door hunting. Yellow door hunting, that is. Utter must und even in a demonic world. Yeah. Utter must und even in a bunker. Another yellow key.
I'm going to assume that's the end. Maybe. Ouchie. Okay, I'm going to assume that this is the end of the of the of the level and episode. So, yeah, I guess I'll go ahead and call it here. <gasps> Surprisingly, I, I, I was surprised to see that there was no player animation. I don't, I don't know, Onyx. I, like, I, I don't know what the deal is. Like, I'm stuck on this, and I can't, I can't, like, do anything else, so. Can you bring, it, can you bring up the map or anything, so. I'm just going to assume that, that this is the end of episode one, so. Yeah. Anyway. So yeah, this was episode one of Wolf and Doom, where we played the first encounter. <laughs> um, let's see. I will say this mod is pretty interesting. I'm liking it so far. It's got some uh, interesting stuff for monster for enemy replacements and whatnot. I still wonder if like the train gunner was um, uh, supposed to be like a boss of some sort but who knows. So yeah I want everyone know um, thank you so much for watching uh, thank you Onyx and Shadow Steve for stopping by and anyone else who may have hit me with a case of alert in my streams um I'm going to try and stream tomorrow, as far as what I'm going to do, I might try more of this mod to see how things go, and thank you uh, Onyx for uh, doing the exclamation point rumble too, but um, if you enjoy what you saw today, and you're watching this on Twitch, get the channel to follow, and become a fellow rumble maniac today, if you want to help me out a little, a little bit more, Possibly able to get to the affiliate status, you know. Feel free to share, share your channel around and help me reach that goal. I'm slowly but surely getting to, 
the, to the affiliate path. But, um, if you're watching this when this gets published on YouTube, get the channel sub, which is basically the same thing as following you on Twitch. Get the, uh, get the video a like, and of course, leave a nice positive, positive comment down below. And, um, Onyx, can you do the exclamation point schedule for me in the chat, please, and thank you? Because, um, I kind of want to let everyone know about how my schedule is going to be for my streams now, because I've cause i kind of got something in mind now. <sighs> So yeah, usually I try and stream around 6 or 7 p.m. CST my time. The days I stream change like a week or two, where one week it's Monday, Tuesday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, which is going to be this week, and then the second week is going is mostly going to be planned for Thursday only, and, and anything else might be test streams. And just to let everyone know, after that Thursday only stream. That's when I go back to the first uh, schedule meals, plan stuff. But yeah, so, that, so that's pretty much my schedule in a nutshell, per se. But um, I hope everyone has enjoyed my blind playthrough of Wolf and Doom Episode 1. Um, let me see if I can get on my Twitch app thing and find out if um, anyone is streaming. Sorry for the silence and all that, it's still looking. I think we're going to go ahead and, uh, is he, is he streaming on Twitch, though? Because I don't know how, because I don't know, I, I don't follow him and stuff, so, so I don't know what he does. Well, what's he, what's he doing right now? If I may ask. I know he's on your Discord, but... I, I know he's on your Discord and stuff, but, uh... You know, I, I don't follow him, so I, you know... But... So he's doing some singing right... So, so, he's, doing, so he's doing some singing right now, huh? Well... I guess we can give Dr. Soundcheck a, a, a case of Raidma. Um, could you type out how how his how his username is spelled, like on Twitch per se? Because like you know, I want to make sure everything's spelled up, put done correctly. <laughs> So 
it's so it's all lowercase. I'm t I'm guessing. Oh. Well, I guess if that's the case. I was I was I had someone else in mind, but I mean, um, I guess we can give Doctor Soundcheck a raid. So um, stay tuned, everyone who's in the chat for a raid. But um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and end the stream. So until I see everyone in the next video or live stream, take care, everybody.